Miami is about to face some serious turbulence, as rumors swirl that the feds have approved the arrest of young Miami, claiming she has been acting as Diddy's handler and has been deeply involved in some questionable activities. The streets are buzzing with accusations that young Miami is to Diddy, what Ghislaine Maxwell was to Jeffrey Epstein. Only some are saying she's even worse. Allegedly, the feds have her on tape engaging in some of the most scandalous actions tied to Diddy's infamous escapades. Not only that, but reports suggest she was responsible for supplying Diddy with illegal substances, alcohol, underage girls, and even some questionable products that have been part of the gossip surrounding Diddy. But it doesn't end there. There are claims that she was also tasked with managing Diddy's victims, either bribing them to stay silent or coercing them in more direct ways. And now, it appears the feds are all over her, determined to make a case against her. It seems like young Miami thought she could hide in the shadows forever, but the time has come for her to face the music. Could it be that she's headed for the same fate as Diddy? And are the allegations against her really as severe as those involving Ghislaine Maxwell? Let's break it all down. Since this scandal began, Diddy has found himself at the center of a whirlwind of lawsuits, federal raids, and a growing list of legal troubles. The authorities are actively seeking to apprehend co-conspirators who have kept quiet for years, helping to sustain what many are labeling a criminal enterprise. Just when things couldn't get any worse for Diddy, he faced yet another lawsuit on September 27th, filed in the New York State Supreme Court. This lawsuit, brought forth by a Jane Doe, alleges that Diddy impregnated her without her consent and that young Miami pressured her into terminating the pregnancy. The details emerging from this lawsuit are sensational and shocking, but can we pause to reflect on the irony of young Miami being branded as Diddy's handler? For context, rumors regarding young Miami's role in Diddy's life have circulated for quite some time. However, things escalated dramatically after Cassie filed an explosive lawsuit against Diddy last November. As many are aware, Cassie accused Diddy of a range of horrific behaviors, including physical abuse, harassment, and the recording of intimate moments without her consent. These serious allegations prompted many to question young Miami's safety and well-being as Diddy's current girlfriend, particularly given the troubling signs surrounding their relationship. Instead of showing concern for Cassie or expressing empathy for Diddy's other alleged victims, young Miami appeared unbothered by the entire situation. In fact, she seemed to relish being at the center of the drama. Fast forward to February of this year, and it became clear why she felt so indifferent. She found herself named in Lil Rod's disturbing lawsuit against Diddy. This lawsuit accused young Miami of acting as Diddy's drug mule for a substance called Tui, which is allegedly his drug of choice. The lawsuit claimed that a witness observed Diddy using the substance in his dressing room and that Miami was contacted to bring it aboard a private jet from Miami. These accusations were troubling enough, but the situation intensified when a new lawsuit emerged, seemingly corroborating everything Lil Rod had previously claimed. According to the new lawsuit, Jane Doe first met Diddy when he invited her on an overseas trip in 2020. Fast forward to the spring of 2022, and Jane Doe claims that after visiting Diddy in Miami, she awoke to find her feet bruised and a bite mark on her heel, completely unaware of how she sustained those injuries. Even more concerning, she alleges that she was coerced into ingesting an unknown substance, which she later learned contained dangerous ingredients. After consuming these substances, she reportedly blacked out, slipping in and out of consciousness, leaving her vulnerable and confused. When she later discovered she was pregnant, the involvement of young Miami became even more pronounced. Court documents indicate that young Miami began relentlessly contacting her, urging her to terminate the pregnancy. Tragically, Jane Doe eventually lost the pregnancy, suffering a miscarriage. While it's unclear whether young Miami's pressure directly caused the miscarriage, it's evident that the emotional distress inflicted on Jane Doe was immense and could have posed significant risks to both her and her unborn child. 
Young Miami's actions are particularly alarming, especially considering she is a mother herself. It raises troubling questions about how someone could prioritize their loyalty to Diddy over the well-being of another person. It seems that young Miami was so deeply entrenched in Diddy's world that her own moral compass may have been compromised. Adding to the chaos is the extensive public discourse surrounding this scandal. People online are raising eyebrows and demanding answers. Could young Miami have played a more nefarious role in Diddy's activities? The internet is alive with speculation, and many are eager to understand the extent of her involvement. Looking back, the timeline of events paints a revealing picture. In December 2022, tensions flared between young Miami and one of Diddy's exes, Gina. During their heated exchange, Miami made a comment that suggested she held a certain level of control or influence over Diddy. Her words seemed to flaunt her status, implying that she could easily have anyone kneeling before her if she wished. This boldness, however, is now seen in a different light, given the serious accusations surrounding her involvement in Diddy's alleged wrongdoings. As Diddy announced the birth of his child with Dana Tran, public scrutiny of his relationship with Miami intensified. Fans began to question why, despite her efforts to showcase her devotion, like renting billboards in his honor, he never publicly acknowledged her as his girlfriend. The disparity between her commitment and his lack of acknowledgement raised numerous red flags and led many to speculate about the true nature of their relationship. When federal investigations began to emerge, young Miami attempted to distance herself from Diddy, even going so far as to spend time with her baby daddy, Southside, to create the appearance of a breakup. However, fans saw through the facade and many criticized her for attempting to escape the repercussions of her association with Diddy. This prompted Miami to present her version of events, claiming that her relationship with Diddy was strictly business or perhaps a mentor-mentee dynamic. In interviews, young Miami emphasized that she entered Diddy's world as a brand ambassador and felt that her presence contributed significantly to his success. She claimed she had elevated the profile of his brand, suggesting that they were both reaping the benefits of their partnership. While this may be her perspective, the weight of the allegations against her casts a long shadow over her assertions. The reality is that the feds are reportedly closing in on young Miami, and they may have gathered enough evidence to result in serious legal repercussions. If she has any payments tied to Diddy's alleged criminal activities, it would be wise for her to seek legal counsel immediately. Public sentiment is growing increasingly hostile, with many suggesting that she will end up behind bars alongside Diddy, while others are questioning whether she might turn informant to reduce her own penalties. As this gripping saga continues to unfold, many are left pondering the implications of young Miami's choices. Will she face the consequences of her actions and potentially serve time? Or will she find a way to extricate herself from the chaos? Do you think she will cooperate with authorities? Or is she prepared to take the fall? The internet is alive with speculation, and many people are eager to share their opinions. Some are suggesting that her bravado and social media presence were nothing more than a front to mask her deeper involvement in Diddy's alleged crimes. Others argue that the sheer volume of accusations against both Diddy and Young Miami might just lead to a reckoning that none of them can escape. The public's fascination with celebrity scandals shows no signs of waning. As this story develops, it's a stark reminder of the complexities of relationships in the spotlight and the precarious balance between fame, fortune, and morality. What are your thoughts on the situation? Do you think Young Miami will ultimately be held accountable for her alleged role in Diddy's activities? Or do you believe she'll find a way to escape the fallout? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more updates on this captivating story and other celebrity scandals as they unfold.